Tell me a little bit about the background of your company before you tell me about your new product. Well, 10 Acre Chris is about having products that are gluten-free, dairy-free, MSG-free, vegan, in order to cater for all the free-from requirements, but giving a real quality product that gives real taste to people who don't necessarily find it in every product that meets those criteria. And we set the company up to make sure that not only did we attract mainstream, but we enabled anyone with dietary requirements to have exactly as good a product as, as they were getting with uh, others. So this is a premium product and we've, we've come up with a premium marketing concept to go with it and uh, welcome to Ten Acre Village. Thank you very much. The free from market is, is exciting at the moment. Uh, where do you think your place is in, in terms of uh, crisp manufacturing? Some crisp manufacturers do have some of their products that are meet some of the free from credentials and ready salted and naturally free from gluten for instance but what we've managed to do is get all our wide variety of flavors everything meets all of the free from criteria so in order to do that we've set up a dedicated plant that does nothing but free from products so there's no risk of contamination and we've got for instance cheese and onion vegan crisps and the vegan society tell us we're the only cheese vegan cheese and onion crisp in Europe so um, we're bringing exciting tastes to people that have been missing them a long time. But well, you're not just a crisp expert now are you? No we've launched at the show our range of popcorn again meeting all the same criteria free from criteria again in some exciting flavors so we do have uh, sweet and salty but we've also got sour cream and chive, fennel and lemon, lime and sea salt and wasabi to cater for a wide variety of palates. So that seems like a, perhaps a smooth transition for you from crisps to popcorn? Yes, we always intended to launch popcorn from the start of the business, but we decided to phase it because we didn't want to do everything at the same time. Uh, we only launched the crisps at the beginning of this year, so um, the evolution to the popcorn has come for us just at the right time. Um, we've established ourselves in the marketplace and now we're looking to broaden our appeal to offer more exciting products to our consumers. How would you describe the show that we're at right now? This is a specialist show um, for people who specialise in quality food, which is why we wanted to be here. And it attracts buyers who are interested in premium products. So it's a great place for us to be. There are a lot of artisan producers here and a wide variety of food types and drinks. And one of the things that we've been surprised by is quite how many visitors have been from overseas. We've had quite a lot from Sweden, Denmark, Finland, um, Italy, France, Spain, uh, and all points. So it's been very interesting to see so many visitors and that this attracts a, a very wide audience.